uh, we are at the end of the last slide of uh, unit 1 sometimes uh, questions are asked in which you have to synthesize the waveform using gate signal A gate signal is something which is starting at a time t is equal to 0 going up to capital T and having magnitude let us suppose A. This is this can be represented as A U T minus U of T minus T. For simplicity A is taken as 1. So, if we have any waveform, for example, this waveform, what we can do is, we can take a signal of slope 1. This function will be written as t. To this signal, we multiply a gate up to t is equal to 1. On multiplication of these two signals, we get t u t minus u t minus 1. Thereafter, we introduce another gate from 1 to 2 whatever be the magnitude here incidentally the magnitude is 1 so the next gate is u of t minus 1 minus u of t minus 2 add both of these and we get the signal wave for ft as t ut minus u t minus 1 plus of u t minus 1 minus of u t minus 2 which can be further solved as t u t minus t minus 1 u t minus 1 minus u t minus 2 in the form of a ramp function and step signal T U T is R T. T minus 1 U T minus 1 is R T minus 1. And this is U of T minus 2. By direct method also you can see the first slope is M is equal to 1. Then M is equal to 0. Again M is equal to 0. And a magnitude change of 1 unit. So it gives you RT minus RT minus 1 and then a change of minus 1. So U of T minus 2. Both these answers are same. So the direct method is easier. But sometimes when you are asked, do it using gate signal, then you have to adopt the slightly longer technique. And let us take the Laplace transform because we are doing the Laplace transform application. So the Laplace transform becomes 1 over s square minus e raised to the power minus s over s square minus e raised to the power minus 2s over s. This is our answer. 2013 in IP University, there was a question which was something like this. The question read, Synthesize the given waveform and find out its Laplace transform. It was a six mark question. Now, using gate signal, first and foremost thing is we have to write down the equation of these lines equation of the line AB and equation of the line C. For equation of line AB, what is the slope? 4 minus 0 divided by 2 minus 0, that is 2. It is passing through a point 0, 0. 
So y is equal to mx plus c. 2 into t plus c should follow. Zero, 0, So 0 is equal to 0 plus c which gives you c is equal to 0. An equation of line ab can be written as y is equal to simply 2t. Second, equation of line cd. The slope is 2 minus 0 divided by 4 minus 2. Which comes out to be 1. Equation of the line becomes y is equal to 1 into t plus let us call it as c dash. And it passes through t is equal to 2 the value is 0. So, 0 is equal to 2 plus c dash which gives you c dash as being equal to minus 2. An equation of the line becomes y is equal to t minus 2. Now, we have two equations y is equal to 2t and second equation y is equal to t minus 2. Now, let us see which are the gates that you are going to use. The first gate will start from t is equal to 0 and go up to t is equal to 2 which will be for this and the second one will start at t is equal to 2 and will go up to t is equal to 4 which will be for equation 2. Therefore, the function ft can be written as 2t u of t minus u t minus 2 plus t minus 2 u of t minus 2 minus u of t minus 4. Now, we can take the Laplace transform, but before taking the Laplace transform, one step is necessary that we have to convert it into step and ramp. This is in fact a problem which is slightly difficult because you have to arrange the terms. Let's see how we are going to arrange it. First of 2 t u t. So, it can be written as 2 t u t which is equal to r t minus again 2 t u of t minus 2. There are certain more terms. Let's combine them plus t u t minus 2 minus 2 u t minus 2 minus t u t minus 4 and plus of 2 u t minus 4. Now, allied terms you have to combine together. u t minus 2, u t minus 2 and u t minus 2. u t minus 2. But here, you are having t multiplied onto this. Here you are also having t multiplied onto this. Here you don't have this is a step signal. Here again you don't have. Here there is a t multiplied. So what you have to do is take out terms such that you have the outside term and inside term as being equal. So here we are having these, these terms. We have to express it in terms of ramp and step signals. First one t u t is 2 r t. Second one, minus 2 u t minus 2 and t u t minus 2 gives you minus t u t minus 2. Thereafter, we have copied the same terms and we have written t as t minus 4 plus 4 multiplied by u t minus 4. This is being done so that t minus 4 in the next step will combine with u t minus 4 and give you r t minus 4. And the second term 4 u t minus 4 can be combined with this. So, let us see how we are in the next step. 2rt minus, this t is written as t minus 2 plus 2. Again, this term is same, t minus 4, u t minus 4, same, 4 u t minus 4 with a negative sign here and plus 2 u t minus 4 here. These two terms will combine together and will give you this term. This term 
t minus 2 multiplied by u t minus 2 gives you r t minus 2. And with the negative sign, you have minus 2 u t minus 2. Minus 2 u t minus 2 along with this in the next step will become minus 4 u t minus 2. And t minus 4 u t minus 4 is r t minus 4. And this we have already seen is minus 2 u t minus 4. In the next step, 2 r t minus r t minus 2 minus 2 u t minus 2 minus 2 u t minus 2 gives you minus 4 u t minus 2. And minus r t minus 4 as it is and minus 2 u t minus 4 as it is. Which on taking Laplace transform gives you 2 over s square minus 2 over s square e raised to the power minus 2s minus 4 over s e raised to the power minus 2s minus 1 over s square e raised to the power minus 4s and minus 2 over s e raised to the power minus 4s as answer. But now let me show you how this question could have been done without using gate signal. Actually in the question it was written using gate signal. So we adopted this technique. Otherwise this question could have been done in a very very simple way. First slope change from slope 0 to 2. Second slope change from slope 2 to slope 1. And the next slope change from m is equal to 1 to m is equal to 0. So there would be three ramp signals, one at t is equal to 0, that is RT. Another at t is equal to 2 of minus R t minus 2. And another at t is equal to 4, again from slope 1 to 0, so minus R t minus 4. Now, let us see where are the jump in magnitudes. At t is equal to 2, there is a sudden decrease from 4 to 0. So, minus of 4, u t minus 2. And here there is a jump from 2 magnitude to 0. So, minus 2 u t minus 4. Uh, on comparing the answer, we find that uh, here it should be 2 because the slope change is from 0 to 2. So, 2 RT, next term, minus RT minus 2, next term, minus 4 UT minus 2, this one, next term, minus RT minus 4, this term, and minus 2 UT minus 4, this term. And the Laplace transform answer will be the same. Thank you.